Hi buddies. Welcome to this tutorial on ECDA. If you are someone who wants to design electronic circuits, create schematics and even make PCB layouts without spending hours learning complicated software, then ECDA is going to be your best friend. ECD is a free online based design that you can use right in your browser. So you don't need to install heavy programs on your PC. With ECD you can quickly draw circuits, run simulations that test them and even order your PCB directly from JLC PCB. In this tutorial I'll guide you step by step starting from creating new project, designing a schematic, convert into a PCB layout and finally prepare into a PCB for manufacturing. By the end of session you will have the confidence to start making your own electronic design using ECDA. So let's get to started and see how powerful and simple ECDA really is. Now I am going to learn about how to create ECDA account. First of all, you need to open your Chrome browser or uh, Microsoft Edge. Then type ECDA. At this link now you're going to login or register this login is easy to connect with Google account sign in with your Google account continue Now you select your position, I am use personal, type your name, next, you can skip these steps, I am select pro edition, I am create the account. It is very easy to everyone. This is professional account. Okay. Now I am going to tell about a small description about these tools. Firstly, create new project. File new project. Type the project name. Test 001 save project is created by that place that project has two files schematic and pcb one schematic here and pcb one i am double click the schematic this is schematic layout here is the toolbars. This is component toolbar. You can choose any component here. ECD has so many libraries. Millions of components. There is so many capacitor types. You can choose your capacitors using these filters. Diodes. You can search the diodes, type here part numbers, I am type simple diode 1N 4001. This is the basic diode and place the
now connect the these diodes we can use this wire tool Now I get the component capacitor. Search thousand microfarad. Now I place that part thousand microfarad. Place. I can rotate the diode. Select diode then press space space bar. connect with wires two pin connector Now I am drawing some schematic. For example, it's a bridge rectifier for smoothing AC current, AC voltage. This is the component toolbar. This is the resistors. This is the wire tool. This is bus bar, bus tool. This is the uh, net label tool. This is short flag. This is VCC power tool. Input tool. These are labels. Okay. Input label, output label, or bidirectional label. This one power tool has VCC volts, 5 volts ground and other two grounds. This is no connection flag, test points, polyline tool, arc tool, circle tool ellipse tool rectangle tool text tool and you can select the image also your schematic tables this is the schematic convert to pcb layout tool generate pcb block symbol tool this is align tools left align Align to right, align to top, align to bottom, align to grid, distribute horizontal. Another tools are there. Distribute vertically, rotate left, rotate right, flip horizontal, flip vertical, build on materials netlist tool order parts 
and settings here at this uh, schematic layout view we can change any part any settings here select the part name we can change the name designated code device part number footprint here is the footprint this is the schematic diagram symbol any part have settings here another thing uh, you have the common libraries here this is the basic library this library has basic components but it, but these components are very useful to us resistors variable resistors capacitors non polar capacitors polar polarity capacitors leds diodes transistors npn pnp mosfets p channel n, -pen n channel inductors terminals two pin we can select many many number of pins one line two pin one line three pin one line four pin five pin six seven eight nine ten DC connectors USB mini ports micro these are also connectors voltage regulators screw holes marker points this is workspace these are the basic tools open tool save tool backup tool undo and redo erase tool find tool find similar components similar objects zoom tools zoom in and zoom out and fit to the window fit to the window your whole project area grid size tool this is grid style you can select the fit area to your window using this tool you can change the units inch and millimeters snap tool okay now i am uh, learn about basic theory about schematic designing and uh, component layouts principles okay we can meet uh, as next lesson or create pcb layout diagram okay thank you very much and good day